Hello, good morning, dear friends. I would like to do a flower, like peony. So, what do you need? You need some exercise paper. This one is paper towel. You can see this big roll. You get a janitorial supply shop or get from the guys gas station, right? But if you go to gas station, never mention my name, okay? I didn't suggest you to do that. So you get white color and red color. And uh, my color is not very good, so it's good for, for <clears throat> making a demonstration so that I'm not superior in any, anything. So anything, any material you will use will be better than this. This one is a student level white watercolor. It's already getting dried, but it's okay. So you get a whole brush bottom, whole brush with this white color. And uh, it is not easy to get. Any material you get will be better than mine, so I assure you. So you will start better than me, okay? And then some red color, and only the tip with red. And um, same thing, watercolor, red color. I bought, I got this one mag magenta, and any other red color will work. So do not be stricted if you do not be stressed if you you cannot find magenta. Any red color, even pink color, will work. Okay. So now we get start. Your brush, lie down. You can see your brush has two colors. Lie down your brush, do not straight. Chinese painting, you put your hand straight, but not in this case. Okay, Chinese calligraphy is like that. But in painting, it's different. Let me adjust the angle a little bit. Okay, so lie down the brush. You press one, two, three, from this direction or from this direction up. I would like to go from up to down. One, two, three, like this, and then continue. One, two, three, like that. So, <clears throat> and then you continue apply more white on uh, the bottom and red at the tip. So just uh, very continue to add another layer of paddle, okay? And here you use like this. Now you can be much free. Still apply color white and red. So as you further go on, you will become much more free on it. So do not use a too expensive good brush. Use a less expensive poor brush like this. So you use a darker color to accentuate a little bit here and there does not have to be perfect and the flower is a very free thing and then you will change another brush apply some yellow and white so put white yellow is good enough but yellow by itself may not be so strong white you apply some white make it more opaque not transparent you think it's a good idea? I think. So some white. This is actually more like a watercolor cake because it's getting dried. Watercolor cake is the same thing. When it is, uh, when it is uh, soft with water, it is uh, more runny. And uh, when it is getting dried, it's like this cake. So. Okay, so here we, we suppose this is a flower heart.
I'm not sure the center should be white or dark red. Maybe we will so I am doing it too slow and um, so usually this kind of sp spontaneous painting the faster you go the better result you get. So here I do much faster and I feel more free. However you think it's uh, free to think. And uh, what else do I want to say? Um, so this is roughly the method. And uh, if you feel that this is a mediocre, feel free to say so or think so. It's okay. So I will do another time just to to get more practice Use a darker And when it is getting dried, put yellow. 